It's a pretty surreal day, guys. It's my second full year on YouTube, and I'm gonna tell you exactly how much money I've made in that time frame. What is up, YouTube? It's Luke W coming back at you guys again today with a transparency type video. I'm gonna be going through my streams of income that I've generated through YouTube alone, and we're not just talking about ad revenue here, guys, which you're gonna see is very small compared to the other things that I've done to build an income and also build a personal brand in the process. So I wanna let you know on the 21st of every month, YouTube does pay out ad revenue to its people who have over 4,000 hours of video watched and over a thousand subscribers. So that's the new threshold that they put into place and said you have to be at that level before you can start making just ad revenue alone, guys. So you can see today on the 21st, I got a paycheck and I can't click into it now, but it was $162 from one month of my basic YouTube ad revenue, which is really starting to pick up now. But you guys can see here with the time that I spent on YouTube with my ad revenue, it's only generated $1,085, which is so small compared to the money that I've generated with affiliate links and info products, which I'm gonna touch on right now. So in the beginning, what got me to start on YouTube in the first place? Hmm. Well, I was sitting in this chair with a broken leg because I had broken it skateboarding and I realized I need to start making money online. I don't want to risk my life in a nine to five where if I lose some ability to work there, then I'm out of an income. I want to be in charge of my own income. So having that broken leg really gave me that mindset to think I need to do something on my own. I want to be in charge of my own life. I don't want anyone in charge of who's going to be paying me out except myself. So what I did was actually learn how to make money online through Amazon FBA. That's fulfillment by Amazon where you ship products into Amazon warehouses and they ship them out for you to customers when the customers buy. So I had to buy a course to of course learn all this information and that was from Tanner J. Fox with his Amazon Seller Mastery course. And I'm gonna pull up for you guys exactly what my first major source of income actually was and that was affiliate marketing his Amazon Seller Mastery course. And basically what I would do is give a course review. Hey, what's up guys? My name's Luke and today I wanted to give you guys a little review on the Amazon Seller Mastery course. Uh, the course was made by Tanner J. Fox. He's a 21-year-old Amazon guru. He's making crazy amounts of profit and making probably three times as much as his parents. And I actually, right after my first video on May 21st, 2017, I woke up and I had made another course sale shortly after I published the first video. You can see right down here on June 2nd, I made my first Amazon Seller Mastery course sale and literally the sales started going and going and going and I had made 67 course sales at $100 each from that alone. And that was me just giving a review video and talking about my journey starting to sell on Amazon which was so awesome guys because I could say my first shipment going into Amazon, what it was like. Not only did it reiterate and help me learn myself what I was actually going through and reinforce those topics and concepts in my own mind to really learn them even better, but during that time I started building a little following of maybe 100, 200 subscribers, super small in the beginning, but it was still able to generate a lot of income because this was a niche specific topic I was talking about, Amazon FBA. So I was learning, I was meeting people, this was a very cool thing, and I was even making some money on the side from promoting a course that I didn't even have to create myself. That's what's the benefit of affiliate marketing. And I do uh, provide that for people who buy my course nowadays. If you get that, you can pretty much document your journey selling, and I encourage people to start YouTube based around a specific topic. If you're watching this and you're into cars or anything else, you can take a course on you know building out a new car transmission or something crazy like that, and next thing you know, now you got a course, now you got a following. You can leave links to products that your viewers may wanna purchase right in the video description below. And that's a great way to make affiliate income based on just links and promoting other products. So that's what got me really started in YouTube in the beginning. 
and that's where I started making my first big bucks, you could say, and I was so excited, guys, just to get that internet money. There's a whole nother realm out there of making internet money that just feels so freaking satisfying because you put out the work, you put out the content, and now it's generating you some income. So in my case with promoting Tanner's course, I made $6,700, $100 per 67 course sales. So when you add that on top of Jungle Scout, which is the tool that Amazon sellers need to have to actually find products that are selling really well, it basically shows you inside Amazon like some secret data of how many sales products are making and how competitive they are. So Amazon sellers need this tool. I simply have it linked in my description box below. I've made many videos about this software and it's generated me $2,900 in profit, in earnings, just from promoting that link alone. And I have many other links I promote, Helium 10, any other software tools that I use, Landing Cube that makes landing pages for your Amazon product, all these awesome things I'm able to promote and make little affiliate commissions. So in total, I've made about $5,000, $6,000 with affiliate commissions alone. And now the big banger here, guys, was pretty much creating my own info product, putting out my own hard work and time into building a real program similar to Tanner's. And it wasn't just that. I had taken three other Amazon courses as well as spent probably thousands of hours on YouTube learning from many, many different sources, different ins and outs as well as taking my own experience and answering questions from many others to add on to my own experience of learning Amazon. That's what I compiled into my own course because I didn't wanna keep reiterating the same information to everyone when they asked me a question. I just said, hey, well, I have this course and if you're really serious, you should probably invest in it because I'm not only gonna give you the course step by step and you can hear how I talk and you can hear the clarity in which I can portray things to people and that's what I pretty much wanted to do in my course build something super easy to follow, and then on top of that, offer personal mentorship, which not a lot of people do. The big thing I wanna mention here as well is I only have three, a little over 3,000 subscribers and I'm able to make some serious money. So that's absolutely insane. That's probably why my YouTube ad revenue isn't so big. I only have a few videos over 20,000 views, but just having a small following of 3,000 people, I'm gonna to get to the point here in a moment of how much I've generated, but with my own Amazon course, you can see here $39,000 is what I've generated since May of last year. And you can see the 12 month breakdown of how much money I've earned each month, which is really cool. And this is inside teachable.com. And I have some real estate buddies that wanna make a cool little real estate course because they tell their friends and stuff and other associates and people under them and their business all the same stuff every single day. And I'm like, hey, well, instead of keep telling them the same, same thing every single day, you might as well just make a video course step-by-step step and say, hey, go get my course for $100 or something just so you can brush up on this knowledge, invest that money in it, and you're gonna wanna you know, pay more attention to it. The more you pay, the more you pay attention is what I've heard from Stephen James at Project Life Mastery, one of my big you know, mentor role models that I look up to and listen to. There's so many awesome people on YouTube, guys, but you can see the amount that I've made for my info product, which is my Amazon Seller Pro course, is really big, and that's just in one year. And this is just basically a side note to my Amazon FBA business, which is just generating some serious income every single month, also in a passive manner. That's what got me inspired as well to make money online because it's just so passive, guys. You literally put the work out there and then it just keeps making money for you 24 seven. If you're sleeping, but someone saw your YouTube video in Ukraine or something and bought your course or bought your product through your affiliate link, you're making money 24 seven, 365 because that video is like a salesperson that's out there for you operating all the time. And I just think it's pretty insane and pretty surreal to sit in this exact chair right here where I filmed my first video ever on May 21st and now come back to exactly two years later where I've now completed over, I think this could be my 300th video. I'll put up a number right now and show you how many videos I've uploaded, but 300 videos, that's quite a few. Uh, and I just wanna say to each and every one of you, thank you for subscribing to this channel. A lot of you have said, how come you don't have more subscribers at this point? Why, why aren't you getting so many views on your videos? And to tell you the truth, I don't even know. Like YouTube could be promoting certain people for other reasons or whatever. I really try and 
do my back end keywords and optimize my descriptions and everything. If you have any ideas about what I could maybe do to do better, drop it in the comments below. But I'm here to help you guys and I'm more beneficial to each and every one of you since I have a smaller following so I can actually get in touch with all of you. When I have 120,000, 150,000 people on my YouTube channel, you know, asking hundreds of questions every day, I can't get back to you. And that's the fate that happened to a lot of other people offering Amazon courses and I'm sure uh, things across all sorts of different markets. When they get too big, they can't really answer you. So I'm still in that phase where I can help people out and I'm very proud and happy of each and every one of you guys. Uh, I think 3,100 subscribers, 3,142 right now. And I just can't believe that this is actually my second year going into this thing. It's all about a slow and steady process. The first videos, guys, I pretty much sucked. I can put up a clip of that or what I look like sitting on this porch with that first video. And I pretty much was just like, you know, I just put the camera on and filmed it and uploaded it. And you don't have to worry about uploading your first video because who's really going to see it? That's what I thought. I was like, I'm just going to upload this. Well, at first I thought I'm just going to film it and you know see if i want to upload it but i practiced i just put it on and was like hey what's up guys like super monotone and everything and after time had gone on i'd learned more to feel good behind the camera feel like i could just go talk to it and then just document my journey and that's what gary v says he says go and document your journey don't act like you're an expert right away and that's pretty much what i was doing in the beginning just saying Here's what my first shipping plan looked like. Here's how I did it. You know, I could just give some tips. And a lot of people want to understand what it's like as a beginner to start selling. So new YouTube channels are very beneficial. If you're a brand new beginner, people want to see what it looks like to be a beginner. And that brings me up to say, hey, I just had my dad on my channel who's a brand new Amazon seller. He's about to make his first thousand dollars in revenue with his second week selling on Amazon now. And I'm going to get him on my channel a lot more. But think, you know, if you're a dad, if you're a 14 year old, even I don't even see that many women on YouTube talking about Amazon FBA. So if you have an angle or a, an idea that you can come in and have a different type of vibe to your videos talking about a certain subject, just go for it. Like you will get discovered. You will find out that you have a voice and people want to follow you. And you just feel so great being able to connect to people all over the world. And I'll tell you what, I'm not stopping, guys. Each year I'm going to go back and talk about this. But uh, that's what I have to say right now my second year. I think it's amazing. I think the snowball effect of my channel starting to grow is starting to pick up more, more or less right now. Uh, and I just love every minute of it. So thanks again, everyone, for watching. And please do subscribe to the channel to help and follow the journey. But I'm going to have some videos coming out about my dad and his journey selling on Amazon. For any new beginners wanting to learn more, you should definitely check him out. And I also want to bring a video about how I make my Google spreadsheet and basically track all the profit that I make every month. As well as I'm going to cover some of my favorite credit cards. Well, my top favorite credit card that I use to get triple points for travel when I spend on advertising inside of Amazon and a whole slew of other awesome videos, guys. So thank you so much for watching. Please drop a thumbs up on this video, share it with your friends, and just get out there, get invested, get behind a camera, build something for yourself of your own life. Everyone has a special talent, a hidden potential that people can relate to, guys. So get out there, you never know. Don't leave any regret on the table, just give it a shot. And if you need my help, I have links to my Facebook and Instagram. You can send me a DM, a message, and I will help you uh, start your YouTube journey, guys. Like I said, I don't have too many subscribers, so let's get it before the uh, subscribers pick up and I'm just blown out the water. So thanks a lot, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.